Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lexi and today I'm going to be showing you just a really quick little mini thrift haul. So I went two places today and got a few fun items um, and some pretty good deals. I didn't get to look for as long as I wanted to because I had my three-year-old and my almost one-year-old with me and they were very fussy and ready to get home, but I did get a few good things. I am almost a year postpartum with my last baby and I'm really starting to try to work on establishing what my style as a mom and an individual human is outside of maternity clothes and postpartum stretchy clothes that I wore pretty much all of my 20s because we have four kids all eight and under um but I'm definitely leaning more towards like a granola girl uh cottage core aesthetic with a little bit of like alternative style to it also um so I only got a few things today but I felt like they were all really good deals and really great items so I just thought I would share we went two places. Um, the first place we went was Goodwill and I only got a few things there. Unexciting. I got a pack of kids toothbrushes because I left the boys at my mom's the other day and they all needed new toothbrushes because we've been using like older ones. So replaced their toothbrushes. And then the first clothing item I got all, I got three clothing items there and all three of them were on the sale tags. So they were each $2. I don't know the brand of this, but it's this really soft, long, lightweight cardigan. I love wearing these with like a tank top and jeans. It's just a super, super simple outfit for church and things like that. Um, I don't know the brand, but it's this really like sagey green color. It's not really picking up on camera, but it's like a light green. The next thing I got is this really soft white um, quarter zip sweater, but it's like an actual stretchy sweater material. And it is by the brand um, Vince Camuto. I've never heard of that, but I love it and I can't wait. I think this is gonna be really nice to take for like throwing over a t-shirt or a tank top at my son's baseball games and practices when it is still a little chilly out this spring. And then the last thing I got there is definitely my favorite. It might be my favorite clothing item of the day. And it's this um, quarter zip also, but it's a fleece. And I think the color and the pattern on this are so fun. The brand is Arctic Image, but I'm pretty sure it's like a campground or like camp shop item because it says it's from Durango, Colorado on the chest but I just thought this was really soft and the colors are so fun. And then the next place we went is like a small place that's local to me. I'm not going to show the first few items because I found a piece of shapewear and two bras that were brand new with tags for like three to four dollars each, which was just too good of a deal because some things are shrinking a little now that I'm not breastfeeding and um, I'm also losing some weight. So I'm trying to get some again not nursing bras and things like that so I grabbed those and then I got this shirt it is by the brand rewind this was five dollars and it's this lightweight flowy floral yellow top I actually have a dress that's in an almost identical pattern to this but I thought this would be really nice for springtime and then the last clothing item I got is this pair of pants. The brand is Knox Rose. So they're from Target, but they are this um, green wide leg, like loose, they're a linen type material, but I know that they're not actually linen, but you kind of get the idea of them. And they have like the stretchy, not waistband. So I thought this would be nice to wear with like a plain t-shirt or something to church. So I grabbed those. Then the last thing I got was so cute. I don't know when I'm going to do this, but I'm hoping to find time to do it with um, my husband as like an activity we can do in the evenings. And it's this book bucket list puzzle. So you can kind of see like what it looks like on there. It's a thousand pieces. Here's an actual picture of the puzzle. But 
that is just like my whole vibe so I thought this was so cute and when I eventually get it done I am going to actually frame it and put it up in my office but this was five dollars and these puzzles can be super expensive and I love this one with the books and stuff like that so yeah that is everything I got today thank you guys so much for watching I do plan on doing a bigger thrift haul in a couple of weeks it's my 30th birthday in a couple of weeks and I am definitely trying to really like establish my wardrobe of things that I actually like and feel comfortable in in this phase of my life so as my 30th birthday gift to myself I'm going to go shopping um either by myself or I might just have my baby with me my husband and our older three boys are going camping the weekend before my birthday so I'm gonna try and do something that weekend so if you would like to see another thrift haul please subscribe down below I have new videos coming out weekly right now um, I share a lot of like home making content so I have a cleaning video and a grocery haul I believe coming out between now and then so thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day